This episode is rated M for magical dogs. Or male nudity. Well, senior citizen male nudity, if, uh, if that's your thing. What are you doing, man? Lord Sappho has spoken! Get off of me, you old pervert! You've been given every chance. Your right to youth has been relinquished. We are oh, war, shit. not love. We're doing it right this time. Uh, oh, thank God. That was so awful. Did you hear what they were saying to me? Would you give me a ride home? I, I don't want to walk back on my own. Yeah, I don't blame you. Come on, let's get out of here. Thank you. I'm staying just off Sonora Road by the Redwood Lights track. So what the hell was that? Who were those guys? I've no idea. I was just talking to a friend on my cell phone when I heard them behind me, yelling about the Industrial Revolution and the Internet. At first I thought, oh, a couple of senile old-timers must have wandered out of the nursing home. So I'm like, did you get lost? Is there anyone I can call? Then... They start really shouting at me how I'm dead wood, that I've failed as a generation. Hey, and next thing you know, they've got me pinned down on the ground. Terrifying. It was so disgusting. They stink like spoiled ham. Crispy hands all over me, ranting about how technology is evil. Yeah, except they was in a car. Exactly. I, I'm thinking... Maybe they're like those weird religious folks who live out east that you see on MeTV, who publicly reject modern life, but secretly drive to the farmer's market in a pickup and era sneakers. Rejecting television by being on television? Right. But then they start going on about a manifesto wanting to drink my blood, and I realize that this is something way more sinister. Some kind of freaky baby boomer cult. So weird. They kept saying that youth is wasted on me. But... I've ruined society. Shit, which is rich coming from the generation that screwed everything for everyone but them. I know, right? The generation before them survived the Great Depression, fought the Second World War, and built America to greatness. Then they stepped in and squandered it all. And it's our generation taking all the flack. Blame the millennials. Even if we are self-entitled narcissists who expect three-hour workdays, who do you think we learned it from? Shit, I don't know. If you're looking for a college debate about middle class problems, I ain't your boy. Anyway, I'm exhausted. I don't want to talk about it anymore. I just want to get the thought of heavily armed, barely clothed senior citizens out of my mind. Barely clothed? I don't think they were wearing clothes at all. Let's drop you off. Here we are. Thank you so much. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't come along. No problem. Don't go inside or anything. Just just stand outside and smoke. Uh, by the way, hello everyone and welcome back to more Stephen Plays Grand Theft Auto V. What you witnessed, or maybe the lack thereof, uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to show it. Probably won't show it. There were some creepy old people who were completely naked. Two guys. Their, uh, their wangs hanging out. Because GTA 5 shows that. Uh, but we can't show that on YouTube. And uh, they abducted that girl, or were attempting to. Or attempting to rape her? I don't know. We saved her life. Also, at the end of last episode, I said it was going to mom my car. I totally did. It is tricked out. It was all free. I'm riding around in style. Now, the one thing I haven't tested, I haven't seen if it's free at other custom shops. And I also haven't seen... Uh, if I can bring Michael's or um, Trevor's car here and get it modded as well. I assume I can, but I'm not entirely sure. But I'm sure I'll find out at some point. Anyway, let's get started doing something. Oh, actually, we're right next to a Strangers and Freaks mission, so I guess we're going to do that. What's going on exactly? It's a puppy! Hey there, little fella. Hello, boy. What's that? You said a man is stuck in a tree. And he needs my help? Part of you would rather leave him there because he's a bit of a dick. <laughs> but you're doing your civic duty. Okay, shit, show me. 
Um, that's a bit wild. Franklin can speak dog, everyone. Just thought I should uh, throw that out there. I also left my. Lost my damn mind. Yeah, you have. You really have. What, it's boy? hard to tell where we're going. He just jumped out of a fucking helicopter. <laughs> His parachute fell to open. And now you kind of wish he'd missed a tree. But morality is a human construct, and you are not hardwired to think that way. I can't believe I'm getting smart talked by a fucking dog. Say what? Wait, you talking about my kind of bitches or yours? This shit is getting weird now, man. Franklin, you are speaking to a dog. I really hope that everything man, that Franklin wrong. said was true. Fool. Oh my god, it is. Hey, buddy. Hey, bro! <laughs> you mind giving me a hand here? Man, that's a cool-ass dog you got, homie. What dog? <laughs> That dog that saved your, saved your ass, man. Dude, I have no idea what you're talking about right now. What the fuck? Hello? <laughs> when you got a moment. Here My you. bad, dog. <sighs> oh. Oh. oh, man, that was wild. <sighs> Woo. See, I'm not an adrenaline junkie. I'm a control junkie. Yeah, that parachuting is intense, man. And hey, if along the way I figure out what it means to be alive, well then, let's just make this a little spiritual and say I'm on a thought journey. <laughs> shit, nothing helps me think clearly like shitting myself while I'm heading towards a certain death, man. Then you're up for it. Not really, dog. Shit, I respect gravity. Oh, <laughs> I knew you were a pussy. Come on. It's safe, I promise you. Safer than driving a car. The only way it's safer is if you drive a car out of a fucking airplane. Come on! <laughs> let's go! What? Follow Dom. What's up, Dom? You're interesting fella. Are we? Here comes my Is pilot. It? Let's next level this shit. Yo, oh my God. Jeff! You want to take a bit longer next time, dude? Fuck! I gotta learn how to say no. <laughs> well, looks like we're gonna do some parachuting. Get in the helicopter. All right, let's do it. Why not? I'm game. You take the left side, man. The left side. You're on the left yeah, side. Yeah, I said left side, man. You know the one that's not on the right. You're the Here's one that the moved. Here's a headset to keep in touch with the Dominator and a parachute to stop you from dying. All aboard. Okay, Jeff. Round two. Set her up. Run to that, buddy. Uh, you sure you're okay? That last one was in fucking sight. Dude, how crazy was that? I was dropping like a dot com stock in late 2000. Cat out of the window. Tell me you got it, please. Tell me you got it. We gotta upload that shit right now. I'm uh, sorry, man. It's all out of focus. I couldn't keep you in the shot. I, I thought you'd fret for show. Oh, man. I could hear myself screaming. But inside, I was ice cold. Totally present in the moment. Like, for a few seconds, I saw everything, and it all made sense. You know what I mean? Like, everything. Shit, man. Until your crazy ass hit that tree. <laughs> Dude, did I choose the tree, or did the tree choose me? You know what I'm saying? Journey that matters, not the destination. Am I right, Jeff? Dominator, buddy. You are the dominator. Because in the case of skydiving, shit, the destination seems kind of important to me. <laughs> what syllabus did you rock? AFS? You all good with the PLF? Say like, what? What's your training background? Man, I found your crazy dumbass in the tree, and now I'm here. That's all the background your ass need to know. Virgin in the drop zone. Hymen in the hole. <laughs> No, but seriously, I got you. Don't sweat it. It's not rocket science, although it is in some ways. But I'm talking metaphorically. Like, like you with that dog. I didn't get that, by the way. Wait, wait, hold on, man. So you telling me you have no memory of a fucking dog? <laughs> there you go again. It's off kilter, and I dig that about you. But we need to get on the same page, bud. Strategize and synergize. You feel me? Like the double helix. Man, all I'm feeling is regret on a whole new level. Take the tampon out, bro. It's like riding a bike, except at 100 miles an hour head first towards the ground. You can't go wrong. Am I right, Jeff? Statistically, safer than having a wank. What the hell? Yeah, man, you can totally get infections, you know? If you leave it too long between washes and, you know, yeah, it's a bad thing. Trust me, okay? Okay, guys, <laughs> let's keep this hand row. <laughs> all you need to do is pull that ripcord there. Ideally, before you hit the dirt. So there's only one thing to remember, right? But your ass managed to forget it on your last dive. Oh, ho, ho. funny guy. Yeah, we'll see. 
<laughs> Guaranteed! All right, I'm gonna jump second. Get that chocolate rainbow on film! Man, you two are dicks. <laughs> hey, you see that mountain up ahead? That's our DC. Our what? Drop zone, dude! Get with the acronym, seriously! So if you check your rig? Man, I don't know that one either. No, your rig. Your pack. Your fucking suit, bro! Every diver checks his own rig. Something goes wrong, it's on you. Wait, man, so how the hell do I... Okay, no more talking. We gotta get our minds <laughs> in the game. Eyes on the prize. Think about gravity. Switch off before we switch on, you know what I'm saying? It's you against nature out there. There can only be one winner. Fuck, man, what the hell am I doing here? Everything's gonna be fine, Franklin. Have a little faith. Do it. The sky, dude. How on oh, earth? Oh shit! To the landing zone. Ah, they're talking on that summit. Rings are all been slamming home. What? Stop talking in pussy metaphors. Do you see the bikes yet? Bikes? You didn't mention no fucking bikes. Oh, I'm coming in. Ay, 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 man. This is nuts. All right. I'm, I have done some parachuting Whoa! at the, uh, at that one class at the flight school. So I should be good. Get on the bike. Jesus, it never hey, so ends. about that training? Where's the... Oh, there's the bikes. I still have a gun in my hand. Let's put the gun away. Bicycle. Yo! All right, I'm waiting. Sorry. Where are you? Did you make it? You dead? It wouldn't be so bad, you know. Where you at? My God, you're taking for. <laughs> you're still way up there. Man, I could shoot him down. Okay, well, this Strangers and Freaks mission was interesting. Caught me off guard. A little longer than I was expecting, too. And he lands it. I'm waiting on you. Oh my god, I just realized that there's a bell on the bikes. Oh, that's cute. Ring, ring. Ring, ring. Alright, come on. Okay! Last one down the mountain bike, the protein shake! Alright. Oh my god, I'm screwed. I'm screwed! Holy crap. Pretend you're your dog and hang a left. Oh! Oh my oh, god! Oh, oh. Gnarly stretch here! Don't bonk it! Oh, Jesus! Holy crap. Oh my god, <laughs> this is really dangerous. Also, how am I supposed to race him, man? It's gonna be real hard to get ahead of him. Cause he's already ahead of me. Oh, I'm good. Jesus. Ah, ah, ah. We're good. Keep going, keep going, keep going. I'm Jesus. Yeah, this is uh, almost going to cost me my life if I'm not careful. Shit! Even bigger jump! Ah! <laughs> oh my god! This is cool though. We should do this in online sometime. A big bike race down the mountain. Jesus! Whoa, massive air alert. I'm going to catch you, you son of a gun. You just hold on. I'm coming as fast as I can. I'm tapping eight faster than should be possible. Why can't I catch this guy? Is it, I mean cycling and stamina are under stamina, All right? Like a semi -buddy, and I oh god! Hard on. Oh my god! Ah! Oh, break, 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 break. Nope, 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 nope! Not breaking, not breaking, not breaking, not breaking, so I can catch you. I can't. Jeez, I cannot keep up with this guy. Is it possible to beat him? Bunny hop. Although I think I slowed down majorly by doing that. Maybe he needs to be in front of you so he can tell you where to go and when to break. Because otherwise you'd like be dead. I don't know. But if this is a legitimate race, it doesn't feel much like... Oh, God. 
Hi, Road. I'm good. Mm. My thumb's getting sore. Coming around to the left. I hit a coyote. I feel kind of bad. Although I hit one with an ATV not long ago in an episode, and I didn't feel bad, but... That was, uh, that was Michael. Franklin's got a conscience. Yeah, that makes sense. I'm catching up. Skipping some of this junk. Wow. Right at the end. Ah, yeah, I didn't kill myself, and you wasn't even pushing it. Whatever, bro. I know this bike. I know this body. I was operating at the perimeter of my parameters, and you were being reckless. And now you're having a winch. A what? Listen, meet me by the airport when you're grown up here, all right? Wow. That was, uh... New contact Dom. Mission passed. Risk assessment. Dude, that was... That was nuts. Holy crap. Okay, well, um... Parachuting is now available. So that's something. Oh, God. Oh, God. Jump it! Oh, I'm going... I'm going fast. I'm fine. I'm fine. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. What's up, Semi? Oh, wow. It's a freaking... Did he just run under the co Wow. That was kind of dumb, buddy. Oh, you're still alive. Ding, ding. Ding, ding. And there he goes. All right, let's do something else. For the record, I was on my way home and uh, kept getting <laughs> my cars destroyed. Couldn't find an easy way out, so I decided to ride this train. This train isn't actually going where I need to go. I've managed to crawl onto the top, and I don't think there's a way to drive the train, but I was wondering if, if it was possible to kill the driver. Apparently it is. How does that affect the train? I'm guessing not at all. Like, it just continues to go. Oh god, how do I get off the train? Get off the train! Oh, I'm fine. And there it goes. Killing the driver of the train makes absolutely no difference. Hey! What you a bad asshole. motherfucker, huh? You ain't shit! Do you want me to get the law on you? No. <laughs> Whoa, hey, hey, no, 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 I don't want any trouble. Hey, I don't want any trouble. Doggone it. Man, you guys are going to swing okay, first. Okay, badass. Bullshit. Huh? You want some of this? Bring it on. <coughs> now I have a star. Whatever. It's your freaking fault. I didn't do anything. <coughs> Jesus. <coughs> Guess what I'm going to do, Al. Hold on. What do I got? A bottle. That'll work. Oh, God. Yeah, you don't like weapons, do you? No, 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 no. You started this. What'd you think was going to happen? Come here. Come here. Oh, God. Oh, God. I ain't going back to jail. I ain't going back to jail. It's cool. It's cool. Everything's fine. Pleasure seeing you, officers. I uh, cannot say for sure what happened to that lady on the road there. That's a real shame. Hmm. Bottle marks that probably match this bottle. That is very odd. Can't say I saw anything, sir. Well, gotta be going home now. Maybe you should just mosey along. You should mosey. Your buddy's waiting on you. Good night, old friend. Uh, not that I meant anything by that. Um, uh, never met her. What it do? How you doing, officer? You good? Okay. Wait, where'd the... Well, this is awkward. Your buddy seems to have left you here. Have a... Have a good... Are, are you seriously gonna walk? Do you have any idea how far away we are from the police station? Hey. That's preposterous. Anyway, um, that's actually going to be it for this episode. Uh, we've done quite a few things. 
in this episode. Uh, kind of a short one, but to be fair, uh, yesterday's, not yesterday's, last episode was pretty long, so I think that's alright. And the last few episodes, we've done kind of some weird miscellaneous stuff, and uh, I'm a fan of that. I think it's nice to try other things and do, you know, random stuff, go out and just drive around, see what happens. And we did car modifications, which is something I really wanted to do, and I'm really excited we got a chance to do. That's going to be it. Next episode, we'll get back to doing uh, quote-unquote real things. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time. <laughs> this guy's your worst nightmare. Don't leave me here. Oh my god, they were going to bury you alive. Jesus. That's crazy. I got you. No worries. I heard you're interested in taking care of some lost travelers for a price. <laughs> so it is. So it is. Leave the body. Take the gold. Come on. Ooh! Ooh!